Hey guys, how's everyone's day? Hope that it's well. <laughs> Alright, so um, in this video we're going to draw, we're going to be drawing mudkip. I'm going to show you guys how to draw this mudkip. But um, yeah, I don't know if it'll be like difficult. I don't think it'll be that hard. Hopefully it's uh, something everyone can do and we'll see what we, we'll see how it goes. Alright, all right, so um, all right, so to start off, alright, to start off we're going to draw us a big circle. And this circle I guess you can like, it's kind of like just an egg on its side, I guess you would say, because Mudkip has that kind of head, right? Mudkip, ha Mudkip has a <laughs> has just like that egg-shaped head on its side, All right, and that's good. So now we can draw the big fin, which is on the top of its head, and it's just like a loop. It's just a loop. Um, it loops to the back part of the head, passes a little bit, and then um, we could draw the cheeks. The cheeks, you know, the left side cheek, and then of course the right side cheek. And that's good. That's good. Alright, so now we can draw the eyes and the eyes. Right, the right eye and then the left eye. We're just going to leave it like that for now. Because then we're going to draw the mouth. We'll come back to it. Uh, the mouth is just aligned to the sides of the cheeks. That's all it is, really. Nothing too difficult, I guess. <laughs> and then you have the... Um, we're going to do the highlights in between... I mean, inside the eyes, I guess you would say. And these are the highlights that make um, the Pokemon look cute. So like, you know, the white circles that are in like the dark eyes, it's that sort of thing. And then each look like that and then it's good to go. And then you are going to have to draw the spikes on each side of the cheeks. Now the left side, I guess, really there's no shape to it. I guess you just have to follow the way it looks. Um, um, and then the right side, of course, all right, so the right, well, the right, okay, I just want to make sure that you guys know that the right side has, um, has, you know, has, like, a line in between, right, like, the line passes a little bit, so, because it looks sort of like, I guess, that it's coming towards you, and then you can draw the front part of the body, and we're going to stop it right there, because I want to draw the left side of, you know, the paw, the left paw first, which we could just do like that, and then the right paw, we're going to draw... It's going to look just like that. Now we could draw the belly. And then the back part of the leg. Which goes up to the belly. And it looks just like that. Great. We're almost there. Alright, so cool. Um, now we can just draw the back fin. Um, it's just, you know, the tail fin. It's, uh... I'm not really sure what kind of shape it is. It just kind of loops just like the, um, the top fin on top of the head. And then you could just draw the lines that are inside the fin that makes it look like a fin, just like that. And then we're gonna draw the lines that go on the top the part of the, the top fin, just like that. Perfect. All right, guys. Now we're fixing and erasing things. Um, just a couple of things we got to do. So where you see the right side of like you know the cheek on the right side, there's a line that the head passes through. That circle you know what the circle is, that shouldn't be there anymore, so we can erase that, and it's going to look just like that, perfect. And then the left cheek, we're just going to erase a little bit of it, and then like kind of fade it out a little bit, so like the lines are going to fade into each other, and that's just for like, so it, like, it looks like it's going away from you. And we're going to do the same thing to the mouth in the middle. The lines are going to like fade into each other because it's like, that's like the closest part, I guess. I don't know, it's, it's just, it looks cool. I, I do that usually. <laughs> Uh, it's usually because like something is coming towards you, and then um, and then the top part, the top head, we're gonna just erase that because that doesn't belong there anymore, just like that. And I almost forgot, but I didn't forget um, the nose. So the nose is just two dots, and that's it. That's Mudkip. All right, cool. So um, with that, like after doing that, you pretty much have you know Mudkip the way it is. And now it's up to you with what you want to do. Um, you can totally color it. You can outline it and do anything that you want with it. Hopefully it came out the way you want it to. Um, I'm going to show you guys here what it looks like when you outline it. Or, like, you know, just if you outline it at all, it, it might look like this. And there, that that's pretty much it. And I also want to show you guys um, what the colors look like, just in case you guys want to color it. Um, I guess the original colors or whatever you want to do. So the colors look like this. And... Yeah, it's just pretty simple. Honestly, like, it only gets a little bit more crazy if you shade it, right? But, I mean, it's up to you. Like, this is what it looks like if it's shaded. I usually sometimes don't like doing this. Sometimes it, like, gets annoying. But, I mean, you know, I don't know. Some people will probably love shading. So, this is, um, 
this is what it is, I guess. <laughs> and that's pretty much it. So um, I hope that this was helpful. I hope that this was good for you guys. I hope that you guys were able to do something with this. Um, and you smiled a lot because smiling is a fun thing to do and it's good for you. And I think it's good. I think it's good for your health too. Who knows? But um, anyway, I hope that this was helpful and let me know in the comments below or let me know if you guys enjoyed this. And um, yeah, I guess um, we'll see you guys on the next one. Thanks so much. Take care.